As a designer, I often get asked how we bring the design of a home fully together. There are so many different elements and details, and so people often wonder, how do we bring such a curated look to the home? So today, I am so excited to share with you guys some of my insight on how we do our design process here at the Lindy Galloway Studio. There are many steps to what we curate in our design process, but it all is about layering. So I'm gonna walk you through not only our process, but how we layer each element into the home and every step of the way. We lay the foundation of our client's preferences by sharing images back and forth. This really helps us understand what they're looking for and making sure that we are hearing what they're after. This then also is our launching pad into everything else because once we have that foundation laid, it's easy to do the rest. The next part is where the layering really comes in. I see the process of finishes, which is all the things that you can think of that are stuck to the home that aren't gonna come with you. So tile, mirrors, lighting, um, plumbing, appliances, all of those things are the next step in our process that we curate. The biggest thing that we do is we start with tile. The reason for this is because that is such a major moment in a room and it really is that foundational piece of the entire design. Then we move to plumbing and this is where we're also figuring out what finishes we want in each space as well. One of the last things that we tackle in our finishes process is layering those final details of mirrors, lighting, and hardware. This is kind of like the jewelry to the whole room that brings everything perfectly together. The next major phase in our design process is the furniture. This is one of my favorite parts and I also see this as a layering process as well. I start with the big pieces in the room. These are gonna be the standout pieces, the things that your eye is gonna capture right when you walk in the room. So I think of like sofas and chairs and those big staple elements. Then we layer in rugs and art and side tables and of course, plenty of accessories. One of my favorite parts of the design process of furniture is creating some beautiful custom pieces. This is something that is unique to the client and totally interesting and different. It's where we're really curating a piece that's kind of out of nowhere and bringing a vision to life. The other thing that we do is layer in, of course, some beautiful items from our curated shop. This gives a beautiful, well-rounded look in the room. And of course, we always wanna make sure that the furniture is in tune with the finishes, so the entire thing feels really cohesive. The final step, of our process is most important and my most favorite. It's the install day. This is usually about a week and this is where we style the entire home. This is where we get to see all of our work over sometimes two years in a project really come to life. And the best moment is when our clients walk through that door for the first time and see everything that we have all been working on and envisioning and dreaming of for so long. At our studio, we take a very holistic approach to everything that we're designing. We don't design just one room at a time. We design everything holistically together. This allows every room to feel like it's its own thing and its own element, but that everything feels like there is a thread of consistency and a thread of a design that is really thoughtful, curated, and beautiful together. Okay, let's recap all of the major phases in our design process here at the Lindy Galloway Studio. There's first the inspiration, then we move to finishes, then furniture, and the install. Think all about those four steps in our process that bring a home perfectly to life.